Good morning. I just woke up, so don't look at me. It's uh, Fat Tuesday Donut Day. My apron's starting to look like me, see? Yum, yum, meat bump. Anyway, we're gonna make gumbo today. My style gumbo for Fat Tuesday. Mardi Gras, Flosh Nut Day, Donut Day. We got chicken, sausage, shrimp, onions, garlic, chicken broth, garlic, shrimp, shrimp, and more shrimp. Let's get started. You're gonna like this. Oh, we got a new Betty Crocker crock pot. So that's our first first test in this nice crock pot. You're gonna like that one too. And with a name like Crocker, it gotta be a crock. Alright, let's start getting this ready. Alright, I'm gonna cut up my onions and garlic. I don't have to show you all that. I won't bore you with the small details. But I'll show you when I get them cut up. Don't cut yourself. Don't cut yourself on a fat holiday. You can be at an emergency ward with no donuts. And no gumbo. Dumbo. Cut your onions in big chunks for this meal. See? And then chop up the garlic however you like. Big slices, little slices. Get one of them garlic squashers if you want. Betty Crocker. First, I'm putting in these big chunky onions. A brand new five quart slow cooker crock pot. Betty Crocker style. Then I'm taking my sausages. Now you can use different kinds of sausage. They use kielbasa here and andolis and little spicy ones. I think they're called. But I just got pork sausage because I like it. You can make yours however you want. And one thing I like to do with my sausage is take the casing off because it's just me and it's gonna cook apart kind of somewhat maybe well we're not gonna stir it like monsters in there but you get the idea I just like the casings off because I like it look like yourself all right I put half my sausage in there I'm gonna go to come to chicken breasts see and I'm going to cut these up in chunks. See, these are three pieces of chicken breasts. Different knife, different cutting board, whatever. We're clean. I'm gonna put these chunks in there. About chunk size, see? You know, like this. You can make this however you want. You can make it spicy, not spicy. You can use different cuts of meat, more shrimp, crabs. Gumbo. Jumbo. We're going to be jumbo after we eat this gumbo, ain't we? That's some good chicken there. This is going to be all day cooking. It's going to smell so good in here. Because I'm going to be here too. Now I'm going to put my other three sausages in. See, when they break apart, that's great. I don't mind that. Goes how it goes with no casing on there. And then the last piece of chicken. Careful. My gumbo. Let me wash my hands with soap and water. Now we're going to add some of our spices. We got some green lid garlic. As much as you want. Like we need more garlic. We need more garlic. We need more garlic. A little bit of green layer garlic. More garlic is good. Oregano, always good. Italian, French, Southern, however you like it. Oregano is always good. As much as you want. Crushed red pepper. Little heat on your meat. Mm. You can make this real spicy if you want, you know? Real hot, sriracha. I got some sriracha powder, maybe I should put that in there. I think I will, I'm gonna go across the kitchen and get some. Celery seeds. Hope I don't grow some celery out of there. Look at that, that's new. That's how fresh we roll. We got new stuff going on. Fresh celery seed. Mmm. 
I guarantee. Mm-hmm. You don't want this. Tell you what. No, you tell me what. So we see. Paprika. Eureka, Mama got paprika. Another new one. What's this world coming to? All new spices. You understand me? Got some redness. Redness. Paprika. Good flavor. Eureka! And like I promised, sriracha hot chili spice. Mmm. Morning here. Morning. Fire. My gumbo, gumbo. Let me open this up a little bit and get a more in there. Let's pinch it out. Mm. All right, back up. Can of cream of celery soup. Campbell's. Instant. Well, I'll put a little bit more garlic in there. Don't forget these guys. There you go. That's good for you. Cream of celery soup. Going in. Mm-hmm. You like that? Now, chicken broth. Going to open this up. I'm going to pour, I'm going to get some, a little bit out of the can here, the rest of my soupy soup, cream and celery soup, just to rinse it out a little bit, you know, pour that in there, pour that in there, now we're going to put the rest of our broth in, until we think we got enough. Did you notice that I didn't put the shrimp in? You know why? But the shrimp won't take all long, all day to cook like the raw meat. Seafood cooks quicker, so. This is going for eight hours, and in four hours, I'm gonna put the shrimp in, okay? So I'm gonna put that back in the, in the refrigerator. Now, you wait till you see this. I'll show you in four hours when I put the shrimp in. All right, so I used half of this, and this is one quart. So half would be 16 ounces of that liquid. Can you see where it is? See? See the level of the liquid? Okay. Stop messing around. Put it on. Low. And away we go. Is the light on yet? Yeah, light's on. First test in new Betty Crocker. Slow cooker crock pot. 7, 12, 1. All right, it's 10 a.m. This is going to go for eight hours. So at two, after four hours, I'm going to add your shrimp, and I'll show you. And remember, you can buy one of these at that link down below. And this is neat because it's real inexpensive, and it also comes with a travel bag. You know, you can make something, put it in there, carry it, carry it wherever you want to go, parties or work. Or picnics. Okay. Um... Gumbo. Happy Fat Tuesday. Hope, uh, hope I'm not any fatter when I come back. You ain't looking at me, are you? My hair's a mess. What the heck? I told you I just got up. Look at the apron. My apron's turning into my head. Blah, 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 blah. Mm. I'll be back at 2 o'clock. 2 p.m. Let's take a look in there. Smells very delicious. Mmm. Break it up a little bit. I didn't open it yet, cause if you're looking, you ain't cooking, remember? He let heat out. Wow. Still got four hours to go, y'all. You know. Break it up. Get a couple stairs. Get them flavors in there. Delicious and spicy. Okay, I got one pound of this wild caught Gulf shrimp peeled and de vein. I think I'm gonna put it all in. Mm. 
put it on. My gumbo. Frozen, see? We see them in four more hours. I had to get up from my nap for this, you know. I set my alarm clock. Alright. One last look. And that's that. I'll see you at 6 p.m. supper time. Okay? You won't believe how good that smells right now. Alright, 6 o'clock. This is done. Smells delicious. Can you imagine? Mm. Chicken, sausage, shrimp, gumbo. For Mardi Gras. Fat Tuesday. Donut day. Donuts for dessert. And we have some rice made in the Wolfgang Puck rice cooker. So, let me get my plate and put some rice down on it. Hang on. On a bed of rice. That's the kind of rice. That's the style. That can't be Wolfgang rice. Get a spoon of this. Or two. Sausage, chicken, or shrimp. All in one spoonful. Then shrimp, onions. More chicken. More sausage, please. I'm gonna cut that one in half. So tender. Mmm, yeah. Come on over and watch me eat. Take a bite anyway. All right, you could make the same recipe in your pressure cooker too. I'd put everything in the pressure cooker on high for one hour, and you're gonna get that. Okay, let's go for a slow cooker too. Crock pot. Time to eat. Like I say. Gumbo for Fat Tuesday. The beginning of Lent. Mardi Gras. I got some beads. Mm, mm, mm. Pretty hot, ain't it? Cooked all day long. Eight hours in the Betty Crocker crock pot. Here we go. Ooh. What flavor? Mmm. You can change this recipe however you like. You know, you all got your own different gumbos. You know what I'm talking about? You understand? Mm -hmm. I guarantee you're going to love this one, though. With the onion and the pepper in there. And the sriracha at the end. Mmm. It's melting your mouth. That's for sure. Try that chicken. Where is that chicken? There's that chicken. Chicken hiding under onion. You ain't hiding from me, chicken. Mmm! Man! That's so good. Alright, have a happy week. I want to thank Liza for suggesting this to me yesterday. Thank you, Liza. Try it. You'll like it. Everybody try it. Alright, I'm going to finish sleeping in peace. Stop bothering me. <laughs> no, thanks for watching. I'll talk to you soon. Thank you. Mm.